Hi friends, welcome back to All on Law. This is a quick pediatrics, and today we're gonna talk about heart knob, heart knob's disease, disease. Okay. So we're gonna talk briefly about this. Okay. Let's start. H D high definition. Okay. What's the deficient over here? Is the deficient activity of sodium dependent dependent is a amino acid uh, metabolic disorder okay sodium dependent transport system okay transport system remember okay so it's autosomal recessive okay and there is a defect in the transport of neutral amino acids neutral amino acids okay amino acids amino acids by intestine by intestine and renal tubules okay guys right okay right so um, what is the pathophysiology deficiency of tryptophan results in the there's a deficiency of tryptophan very important tryptophan is very important okay so what are the signs and symptoms signs and symptoms clinical features usually asymptomatic remember these patients will be asymptomatic okay they can rarely have what you call psychiatric changes psychiatric changes okay then they give, they will have what is a cutaneous photosensitivity cutaneous photosensitivity ps okay and marginal nutrition results in clinical manifestations in predisposed individuals okay how would you diagnose that how would you diagnose amino aciduria so amino acids in the urine so uh, neutral amino acids like alanine serine threonine valine leucine isoleucine phenylalanine tyrosine tryptophan histidine I, I don't know whether there is a mnemonic for that or not if you have any mnemonic please do tell us through the comments ok and remember there will be a normal plasma amino acid levels ok normal plasma amino acid level can be there ok so amino acid urea of a neutral amino acids like alanine, serine, threonine, valine leucine isolation where do you see valine leucine isolation in which this is msud guys right yeah, excellent how would you treat this disease heart numb disease how do you treat it nicotinic acid or nicotinamide and high protein diet in symptomatic patients only nicotinic acid and nicotinamide or nicotinamide okay and high protein diet in symptomatic patients only thank you so much for watching this video take care